So, another week, spring is sprung, finally. We're getting some awesome weather this weekend. Uh, it's Thursday morning, I'm heading out on my first guard trip of the year. Um, conditions look good. Uh, I'm out uh, doing this for a few days and then uh, we might get the kids out on Sunday doing it. Um, excited, uh, high water usually means, uh, like in 2017, it was probably one of the best years I ever had on the gar because the weeds just don't get up and, and you can get at them real shallow and uh, it's awesome. So we're looking forward to that. Uh, just a quick update on Birdie. Um, huge thanks to everybody who sent us, you know, texts and and, uh, and messages on Facebook and stuff. Uh, really appreciated. And uh, we don't really have anything to update yet. Uh, we haven't heard from uh, neurology yet. So we're kind of in a holding pattern until we do, but Still concerned, obviously, but uh, we'll see where that leads us in the next few weeks, if not sooner, hopefully. So uh, let's get at it. It's gonna be a busy week. <laughs> Tanya's first gar. Oh, she's even grabbing him by the beak. She's crazy. Squeeze, there you go. Now spin him around. And... There you go. Oh my God. <laughs> Well done. Two cast and a fish. Number two. Who's the bigger tanny? Mine. Oh, okay. Which maybe we should have measured it. <laughs> yeah, we should have measured it, I think, eh? Looking for mama now. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Is he in the net? Yes. <laughs> Just tell me you videotaped that whole thing. I do kind of have that. I, <laughs> I don't know how much of it I got, but I got oh some God. of it. You got a little bit of this and then a lot of it. Oh, that's going on the blog. <laughs> I got almost, some of that. Almost had to get a new net. I was diving for my net. <laughs> yeah. Nice. That's a barred one, actually. See how dark he is? Yeah. Not a lot of spots. No, two on his head. That's actually a big one for that for that color phase. You don't see them that a little big. little bit silver on the bottom, though. Pretty cool. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Put your arms out as far as big. That as one's a little bit bigger. What's the peanut gallery say? That's bigger. That's yeah, a better one. That's the biggest one so far. Nice. That's More awesome. to come. <laughs> what do you think of that, Davey? That's a pretty nice one. Look at that dog. Woo wee! It is happening now. They are popping. Wrapping up our day. How many we got? Eight, oh, eight, eight, or nine. eight or nine. Lost nine. a bunch. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> what was that? I think we just hit a big one. Oh, oh, a little yeah. Chunk of crap. Anyways, fun day. Dave was a good caster until the last 20 minutes when he started to go bird hunting. Something in the trees a little bit. He had some buck fever, I think. Fun day. Thanks, guys. So it's super early on Friday morning. Getting to do something cool today. I haven't done this in a little while, but got a carp trip down on the St. Lawrence. So I'm heading down the Long Sioux Parkway. Got a uh, buddy Darren and his kids, and uh, it should be good. I think it'll be good. Um, kind of late spring, and I know they just had a big tournament there on the weekend, and guys caught them pretty good. So I think we might do all right today. We'll see. Yeah, we are. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Okay, stop, stop. Oh, Dad caught something? Yeah, go, go, go. Yeah. That's what I was doing wrong. There. there we go, there we go. Oh, the Gatorade fell in the water, water bud. Can you grab it? Because he's gone over this way now. There he is. Check here. Oh. There's the monster slug. Yeah, that's what they are. Monster slugs. Gotcha. <laughs> nice. Two buddies. buddies. <laughs> No. Doubles. Any of those boys? Nice. Mm. There's some good pictures. Okay, this guy's Jetty boy. Come mm. down here, boys. <laughs> Huge fish. Double header. It's just the three of us. The other guys went to the store. Uh oh. Jake's went for a rip way out. Oh, I see him. Oh. He's big. <laughs> he is? 
Just another double header with the boys. You know, nothing yeah. on there. <laughs> yeah. That's good. So Saturday morning, out for uh, another guard trip. Conditions are perfect, but the issue I'm going to have today is I think it's going to be really busy out here on the guard today. Uh, I'm already seeing one or two boats, and it's fine. There's lots of water, but uh, I found a couple of real special fish I wanted to revisit today. But we'll see. We'll see if we get a shot at them. Um, but either way, we'll find some fish. We always do, and the conditions are great. So let's see how this goes. It should be pretty good, I think. And uh, I think the guy joining me today is going to be a pretty good fisherman. So see what we can do. That was hunting, not fishing. <laughs> and uh, the results? How many, how many casts did I make? Oh, 30, Jeez, 40. 40. And? Amazing. Hello, Chunky Monkey. And uh, that would be my first uh, gar ever. My personal best, and the, one of the best fish I caught since. There we go, Norm. You wanted one. I got one. It ruins the day sometimes when you catch a giant on for your first one, but we'll just look for more giants. That's fun. Let's get some picks for you. So, what do you do for an encore, Norm? Just the 40, 48. 48. You know. Yeah. It's nice out here today. It's nice. <laughs> Chase that one. Uh, a while 300 yards <laughs> but it's worth it yeah that's a beauty okay there we go you're having a bit of a day norman yeah doing all right today buddy yeah <laughs> just wrapping up this week three great days on the water actually four Sundays are family days. We actually went out on Big Rito for a few hours yesterday afternoon. Had an absolute blast. Caught a couple fish. I haven't caught a fish in a while, but uh, caught a couple fish. It was decent just to get out in the boat and just chill. Wasn't working while well, they were giving me a hard time because I'm the guide and we weren't really catching a whole bunch of fish. But anyways, bass opener this week. I know a bunch of guys are chomping out a bit. Some of you have been chomping out a bit a little too much and already been fishing them. I've heard that story too. I'm not going to get into it. I'm not going to name any names. But if you're in shallow water, you know you shouldn't be in shallow water flipping at anything. Just saying. So have a great bass opener. We'll catch you next week and hopefully be some bass reports.